Hi there, I'm Inspector Campbell Hill. I'm the Operations Manager for the Limestone Coast Local Service Area. We just wanted to say good day to everybody coming down for the Lucendale One Night Stand to really talk about two key things being road safety and personal safety at the One Night Stand event this weekend. We've been doing a lot of work in the background for a couple of months now with the event promoters and organisers along with the local council and other emergency services to make sure that you have a really enjoyable time. There's a few expectations that we've got and there's some activity that we'll be doing that we want to let you know about now so there's no surprises over the weekend. The first relates to road safety. Obviously, we are expecting quite a considerable amount of traffic to be making its way through the lower southeast this weekend. What people can expect to see from us is a high visibility road policing aspect. We'll be stopping drivers and testing them for drug and alcohol, but we'll also be keeping a keen eye out for those that are speeding, not wearing seatbelts or driving distracted. What we're talking about is mobile phone use, but also behaviour in the car. If you are driving a car with your friends this weekend, concentrate on what you're supposed to be doing, and that's driving. If your mates want to have a chat, you need to keep your eyes on the road, be watching what's happening in front of you and what's coming towards you. There's going to be a lot of traffic and if you can stick to those principles, you're going to get there safely. In terms of public safety, this is an all ages drug and alcohol free event. The police will be out at the event doing foot patrols. They'll be wearing uh, fluoro high visibility vests. So if you do need police help on the night, there'll be a multitude of police around either on foot, on push bikes or the mounted police will also be down here. Given that it's drug and alcohol free, we're going to be doing some work with our drug detector dogs to make sure that people aren't trying to bring anything into the event that's going to be uh, illegal or unsafe. And likewise, we're going to have a lot of police that are going to be focused on antisocial behaviour and intoxicated behaviour. Our message really is quite simple. This is a drug and alcohol free event and it's all ages. If people are going to be drinking too much and rocking up intoxicated at the event, you can expect that you will be denied entry. And as a result, you're going to miss out on what's touted to be a pretty good night. At the same token, we want people to be leaving safely as well. So we really urge people to be aware of the road conditions in Lucendale at the end of the event. Be aware that we've got thousands of people that will be on foot around the area and follow the local signs with regards to speed and road lane use. And you're going to find that you have a fantastic evening.